Hey there, y'all. Disney D Prince here again. And today I have got another of our Honeybee Acres series. I've got the Around Town Van, which retails at Walmart for $9.99. And then the last three of our Honeybee Acres babies. We've got Baby Binks, who's a dog, Baby Moo, that's a cow, and Baby Hootie, who is an owl. They're a little bit on the nose with the names of these two, but that's okay. Uh, so let's take a look at the babies first, just because they're the easiest to open and then they'll get out of the way. There is Baby Binks. I do love that name. Thackeray Binks from Hocus Pocus is one of my favorite characters. It would have been more perfect if he was a cat or she was a cat, because we've got some eyelashes on her actually. And then this is the back of her. Binks loves swinging back and forth, reaching high towards the sun. All she needs is a good push or a strong wind to keep her moving. So she's got a little swing set in there. So let's get her out. And then we can see where we want to put her swing set. If her swing set will fit in our uh, in our house or not, in our farmhouse. So I am trying to sort of uh, consolidate everything down into the house. So I did go today, sorry, I meant to go uh, earlier in the week, but I got sick, thankfully not COVID, because I did get a negative test, but I just felt like poo all week. But this is what she looks like. She's got really cute blushing. She's got a bit of a white nose, some white spots around her eyes, some brown ears, a cute little red polka dotted diaper. And then she fits in her swing a little bit more. You gotta move her legs a little bit more back. Again, this is one where it could have benefited from a bar that goes across to keep them in there. But if you get her ears behind there, she'll stay in there. Uh, and so we can, oh yeah, that fits up in our, uh, up in our playroom area. So that'll work. And now let's look at baby Moo. So there she is in her box. She's got a slide. And then Moo's favorite pastime is sliding down the slide over and over again. Her best move is sliding down backwards. Didn't we all know a slide kid, y'all? <laughs> so let's get Moo out of her box. Again, there are no, uh, oh, she's got tape on both sides. That's frustrating. Only some of them have tape on all the sides. Uh, Again, these babies retail for uh, $4.99. So basically $2.50 is your basic standard price for any character. So if you have a set that comes with a character, just deduct $2.50 from it. Uh, oh, and her whole thing is taped up also, that's weird. All right, and there she is. You can see her a little bit closer. Get her out of her little staple. She's very cute. She's got some different striping. Not much on the back of her head. She's got a little tail. She's got her hoofs that are pink. She's got some spotting on her arm. She's very cute. She definitely looks like a little cow. Uh, and then we can take her little slide out. Here's the little slide. It is just basic. You can't really, there's no wood pattern to it or anything. There are some flower patterns here on the side, which are kind of nice. Very cute, it's got a little step ladder. We do see that Honeybee Acres B right there. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that again up in our nursery playroom area. And again, this is what Moo looked like. And so our last baby that we have is baby Hootie. 
and she is an owl. And now that I'm looking at her, I'm not sure if she's dusty or if there's problems with her flocking, but too late now. Uh, again, if you care about the flocking, uh, do kind of look closely at some of these because they are all exposed to the elements and things like that. Uh, so we've got her back of her package says meet Hootie. Hootie loves being in her bouncy seat. She has to wiggle a bit and the bouncy seat rolls along. Even Mr. B takes flight as Hootie takes off. Okay, well, we've never met Mr. B, so I have no idea who that is. Uh, here is the little bouncy seat. Again, this has a little thing where she's, like, slapped down, so that's nice. Uh, and that. Here is Hootie. Her head does go all the way around, because she's an owl. Actually, all of them do, but it makes more sense as an owl. Uh, and she's very cute. I kind of wish she had different arms just because owls have wings, but she's very cute. Uh, yeah, like you see the different patterns. She's got a yellow beak. She's got some spots around her eyes. She's got that white face. The rest of her is white. She doesn't have a, oh no, she does have some sort of tail. Hold on. Oh, she just has a little nub of a tail back there, but it doesn't come through her diaper. Um, and then let's take the uh, walker or bouncy seat out. Okay. This is the bouncy seat. It's very cute. It has a little tray table where they can eat. This has a little bit of uh, paint bleed on this part. If you can see that right there. I couldn't see that behind her. Uh, but... She fits right in there, and that works. There's no little wheels or anything down at the bottom like there are on the, like there are on the wagon, but it's still very cute. It's very basic. Uh, we're gonna put that in our nursery area. And now we can move on to our around town van. Now this around town van does have a, uh, Picnic for four included as most of its accessories. Uh, this has 14 pieces is what it says. So with 12 pieces just being the plates and the food and the water bottles and the 13th piece being the basket and the 14th piece being our car, that's everything that comes in this. Now, that may sound like kind of a ripoff, but again, this is still only $10. This is $9.99 at Walmart, retail price. Let's look at this. So let's go. What better way to get around Honeybee Acres or visit the Main Street stores? This van holds a family of four and is the perfect ride for any day. Take a trip through the valleys or over the beautiful sunny ridges. Make sure to stop for a picnic along the way. And then it shows you the different family packs. Uh, and so it does show you everything that comes in it. And so let's open it up and see what it's like. Now there doesn't seem to be any assembly on this one, which is great because with the uh, Busby Farms, we did spend the majority of that video assembling. But hopefully you guys watched that one because it was a really good video. It shows just how frustrating it is for dads who are asked to put these things together sometimes and single moms, I'm not gonna single moms don't do that or some moms who are just handier with tools all parents are equal except for deadbeats and so we've got these little screws that screw in they both fell out though so I don't know how secured they really are uh, and then our car just comes out like this there is a little zip tie right here that is holding that door closed or that door open. Let's see. Oh, these have a little bit of things in them. Let's see. How do I 
So this has a little like latch, but I'm not sure how you're supposed to pop it. It looks like it's just supposed to slide. Is there something in the way? I don't know. Mm. Oh, and there is another zip tie over here. So we've got our door that opens like that. And our other door that opens like this. And these little rabbit family that are in here are just a little insert. And then as you see, we've got four seats and you can see the individual seat patterns on there. Uh, these wheels seem like they're on a metal axle, so I appreciate that. Uh, we've got our trunk that opens up, and again, you've got some more space back there and a little honeybee uh, path, if you guys can see that back there. It's faint, I know, I'm sorry. Uh, and then we do have a honeybee acres sort of license plate back there. I'm trying to see why this is not... Uh, operating on this side. Theoretically, this should come right out. There she goes. Okay, she was just stuck. That's why. Okay. You gotta give that a little pull, I guess, sometimes. Uh, it does have an open roof, which is kind of a sunroof, but that is how big it is compared to the house. It's the same as the ground level. And then we've got our picnic stuff. So again, we've got a, I would have preferred if they had given us a picnic blanket. That would have been nice, other than this cardboard. Uh, I feel like they could have done that. All the other ones came with a rug. Oh, we've got a water ball. Oh, we've got some down already. Here's our cute little picnic basket. It does open from both sides, so that's very cute. Uh, let's see if all of the dishes and things fit in there. So it does look like they are all gonna fit. And we've got our little sandwiches right there. And they do all fit in there. That's kind of surprising. Um, so let's see. So I have the rabbit family that's in the big house. I have the cat family that's in the cottage. So I think the dogs are going to go in the are gonna go in the van because the dog family, the Barksters, yeah, Barksters, I had that right, I'm not crazy, uh, are gonna fit in this one. There we go, we got our family four. And then, uh, fifth one from our playground pals and then we'll put in our other baby binks from the baby set and let's see if they all fit so we've got daddy's gonna drive again these legs are really stiff at first y'all I am always afraid I'm gonna break them and I'm kind of impressed I I haven't broken one on camera yet. Yeah, we're just gonna set him there. He can stand up in there. 
and so can mama. Actually puts them better at the right height. Uh, let's put the kiddos back here in the back seat. Again, these are just, these clothes really get in the way of their uh, legs moving properly, I feel like. Uh, we got those there. We'll put them on either side. And let's put the babies in the bathtub. No, in the seats. All right. And you can fit four kiddos in the back there. See? They're fitting in there nice and gentle like. And our family is ready to roll, right? Okay, y'all. Well, that is our video for today. We got a set moo there. And here is Binx's swing. And we've got Hootie over here in her little walker. And that's it for today, y'all. I've got another video coming up with the final piece of the Honeybee Acres first launch, and that is gonna be the uh, Buzz General Store. So stay tuned for that one. Thanks, y'all. This has been Disney D Prince. If you have any questions, leave a comment. If you liked it, drop a like. And as always, follow if you want to see more. Bye.